Hold on a second. Almost there. Booyah! But hey guys, I'm on a studio right now since I'm going to a, a very first episode that contains the shout out and question and answer. Speaking of which, it is still Gumball Central. And I don't have much of my clothes to wear, so I'm wearing this. It's a white one, shoulder sleeve dress, which is really feminine to me, and a denim short that fits to my size. Um, Gumball, are you going to the studio or you will answer one of the question and answers of your fans? I'm doing a question and answers, okay? So I have a few messages and shoutouts here. Let's go with the shout out. We have the Lenny Season, Tamiki Seven Two Fifteen, Pet Malu Two Two Five, Warpa Fifty One Twenty Seven, and Lodi Santa Maria Twenty Five. Now let's go with the question and answers. If you were a girl, since you're wearing a wedding dress in one episode of The Amazing World of Gumball, what would you do first when some boys watch you? Well, I, I'll just escape, but it might get even worse than that. Something is getting weird, something is getting wild. I am just a magical bride from another dimension. <laughs> just kidding. Next one we have from Chowder. Since your version of a low-budget scenario when you run out of money that may lose some animation stuff which may end up with a storyboard, but... In case you might do another one, will you guys feature in real life and you don't have money for animation? Actually, it's too late, Chowder. You're the first one who did that and I almost crack up. No money means <laughs> no animation. At least I'm still animated. And also congratulations to Mickey Seven Two Fifteen for acquiring the series from Megatoon TV for the Sapang Para series. I've got a question for you. Will you animate me as a cash? <laughs> Just kidding. Just make a promo of it. Well, th that is all for today, so keep watching as I'll try to make an interview featuring the gang of OKKO. OK Bye!